Hi everyone, uh, welcome to this other episode of Actually Learning Physics. So today I will talk, I will teach a very simple concept which you can call science magic. For those of you who know science, it may not look like magic. So today we are going to look at the center of stability and equilibrium. So I have uh, a bottle of, I don't know what. Uh, it is written on a carush. I don't know what it means. And I have water here. So I want to demonstrate, make a simple demonstration so that next time we see the loading compartment of, of cars being at the bottom, no, rather than at, at the top, we shall understand why buses are loaded, are loaded at the bottom. So here I have a bottle, empty bottle. It is an empty tin of 300, 330 milliliters. So uh, this tin here is going to help me demonstrate the effect of the position of center of gravity on the stability of an object. So when I try to balance, when I try to displace this tin towards its edges, it just falls down. Why? We shall see why. When I try to displace it and I leave it, it simply falls down. But surprisingly, when I add some water into the tin, into the tin, as you can see, when I add some water into the tin and I try to displace it again, I can easily see that it can balance at its edges. <coughs> it can easily stand at its edges. So to a layman, that is magic. But to a science person or somebody interested in science, that is actually not magic. It is simply a simple concept of center of gravity and stability. So, <clears throat> this being uh, in form of a cylinder, we can assume that it's pos the position of its center of gravity is at the midpoint. When it's empty, when I displace it, it simply falls because by displacing it, uh, the position of the center of gravity is actually moved to another point that the vertical line through the center of gravity falls outside the base. So it simply falls. But then when I add some water in it, you must have noticed that it can easily balance at the edge. It can easily balance at the edge. I can even try to push it, and it is easily balancing at the edge. The reason is very simple. Pouring in water is like loading the bus at the bottom, loading the bus at the base. Pouring in water, I'm increasing the weight at the bottom. Therefore, it means the total weight at the bottom is greater than the weight at the top. The position of the center of gravity, which might have been at a higher level before, has now been lowered to a lower level. So it is closer to the base than before. When the position of the center of gravity is closer to the base, stability is increased. So by loading buses at the base, we are putting more weight at the bottom of the bus, increasing the stability of the bus. So the next time you see the loading compartment of the bus at the bottom, just know it's because we want to increase stability. I think it has been a very nice uh, observation, nice, nice experience, nice observation, nice demonstration, and I hope you have enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. See you.